Welcome to the online training program for primary level teachers. The peculiarities of pronunciation of words. In this training program, we shall know the correct pronunciation of the words from the English and other subject textbooks. By other subject textbooks, we mean Gintara and EVS textbooks of English medium schools. This module is intended to strengthen the flagship program Mission Prerna of the Basic Education Department, Uttar Pradesh. By developing English pronunciation skills of the primary level teachers of the Basic Shiksha Parishad. Mission Prerna focuses on developing the foundational learning skills of the learners. In the context of English language, it is not a foreign language only for our students but for our teachers too. It is often noticed that the pronunciation of English words is not standard. As a result, many a times the speakers of language are either hesitant or unable to express themselves and at a times the listener of the language are unable to comprehend the expression. Means it is very difficult to say that we are completely understanding what we are listening if our pronunciation is not correct. Secondly, considering the significance of interdisciplinary approach of teaching, language is not taught only in an exclusive language classroom. Even in a non-English language class, that is to say maths, science, EVS, a lot of language learning takes place parallelly with the subjects being taught. These classes provide more opportunities of language acquisition in a more real, practical and effortless way. This calls for equal accountability of other subject teachers along with English language teachers to help the students to speak English words with standard pronunciation. ELTI Prayagraj has designed this online training program to build on the pronunciation of several English words from our textbooks of classes 1 to 5, that is Rainbow, Gintara and our environment that are frequently used or commonly mispronounced so that the teachers are equipped to succeed in their endeavor of preparing the students to speak in English with correct pronunciation and reduce ambiguity. A language spoken with correct pronunciation, stress and intonation is not only a treat to the ears but also increases comprehension of the content being taught. The correct pronunciation paves the way for better understanding of the content. We hope that the teachers are able to better their pronunciation through this training program and through this module. Now let's know in detail about sounds, stress, rhythm and intonation. Let's read this pair of words aloud. But, put, to, go, busy, bury, though, think, machine, chemistry, children, pond, host, pen, pretty, ship, pleasure. Do you find any difference in the pronunciation between the pair of words? Yes, there is difference in the pronunciation of words. 
Let's read these words once again and notice the difference. But, put, to, go, busy, bury, though, think, machine, chemistry, children, pond, host, pen, pretty, ship, pleasure. This proves that there is no one-to-one -one relationship between the words and their pronunciation. Let's look at the letter A. All, fat, faith, father, fair, about, many, village, was. The example above shows that the letter A produces nine different sounds. It means that there is no one-to-one -one relationship between the letters and their sounds. Let's look at another example. CH CH children chemistry machine in these three words ch is producing three different sounds in english one letter can produce many sounds whereas in hindi one letter produces only one sound the sound changes only when a matra is added to it in hindi how a word is pronounced is written in the same manner. This is known as Ninad Anugamani. In English alphabet, there are 26 letters. These 26 letters produce 44 sounds. In that 44 sounds, 24 are consonants. Benjin, 20 are vowels, swar. In that 20 vowels, 12 are pure vowels, 8 diphthongs or vowel glides, sanyukt swar. To represent these 44 sounds, there are symbols which look like small letters of English. These symbols are written within two slant bars. Let's look at some examples which are written in the same way as in a dictionary. Let's look at the word teacher. Teacher in slant bars you will find some symbols T like small t, small i with two dots, again t and yes like e like structure. These are the symbols how a teacher is written in the dictionary. Teacher. Next word, school. Again you will find small s, k, u with two dots, and L and it is also written in slant bars. School, this is how school is written in dictionary as well. So you will find the word book, English, put, but, they are written with the symbols in slant bars. As I have told you earlier that 26 letters produce 44 sounds. In that 44 sounds, 24 are consonant sounds. Now, look at these consonant sounds. They are quite close to the sounds in Hindi. Let's read these words 
allowed p pen spin b bit bubble t take stone d day lid k key talk g gun google ch chain fetch j jail judge m main sum na nail sneak ing ing sound is very particular in english it is not found in hindi like king thing ring so it is n sound la slate tell for fan half v van live th thin bath the then cloth sir set taste the zoo lose sure ship fresh je division pleasure her hat behave r run rub w win swim y yes tune sounds like z zoo and j division of english are not there in hindi z is in urdu but now is accepted in hindi too now friends we will know about vowel sounds as i have told you earlier that there are 20 vowel sounds but in that 20 vowel sounds there are only 12 pure vowel sounds pure vowel sounds means to say that they are not the combination of two vowel sounds they produce single vowel sound let's read these words aloud e look at these two dots in front of the symbol these two dots represent long sound e east beat e it bit a and send a and send a arm calm o on cost o call caught u put pull u us pool a cup hut a earn bird a ago about most of the vowel sounds in english are same as in hindi now all sound is accepted in hindi now we write college instead of college 
In previous slides, we are talking about 20 vowel sounds. In that 20 vowel sounds, 12 are pure vowel sounds and 8 are diphthongs, sanyukta swar. Diphthong is a combination of two vowel sounds considered as one sound. Now, let's read these words aloud. A, eight, gate, O, oak, note, I, eyes, mice, ow, out, shout, oil, oil, boil, ear, ear, clear, air, air, care, ua, poor, tour. In this module, we came to know that one letter produces many sounds. 26 letters produce 44 sounds. 24 are consonant sounds. 20 are vowel sounds. And there is no one-to-one -one relationship between the words and their pronunciation. Thank you for listening me and have nice time. We will meet in next module.